Athens girls soccer is undefeated. The Lady Wildcats are going for their 60th straight NTL conference win, a record that stretches all the way back to 2011. But for tomorrow night's game, tomorrow means a lot more than just a chance at continuing their streak. Every day I think about her and it's hard on everyone. I know like my friends are really close to her, so everyone can just feels for us and we can all kind of share that um, together. And it's still hard for Hannah Reed. Her oldest sister, Sarah, was driving her car on the way back to college just three years ago. The 18 year old and former Wildcat soccer player had just graduated from Athens that past spring. It was a morning similar to today. The rain was falling and Sarah lost control of her car. This week in 2012, forever changed the Reed family. It's a lot of emotions, you know, since it's been, it was just three years uh, yesterday, but it's going to be a great experience for everyone because, you know, she held a big impact on the team. And even if you didn't know her, it's just everyone kind of feels for our family. And so I think it should be a good game. It should be a lot of fun. Fun. That's exactly what Sarah had when she played soccer. In honor of her memory, the Reed family started a tradition. Each year for one game, the whole team wears pink and the Athens community comes out to celebrate Sarah's bright legacy. After her passing, this just kind of started a trend, you know, pink out, wear pink for Sarah, wear pink tomorrow, you know, and then it just kind of stuck. It's great. Like, it makes me, like, it makes me know that, like, how much of an impact Sarah really had on people. And it just makes me feel good how everyone wants to support us and I feel like we have like another connection with Sarah now. Like I know she's our sister, but like soccer, like in all like the pink out games, it brings us like closer. For her sisters, Hannah and Leah, the two current Wildcat players now have a bond not just with Sarah, but with each other every time they step onto the field. Well, it's going to be hard, but you know, seeing her and like seeing that we have each other, it, you know, it'll make it a little bit easier on everyone, I think, and us as well. It's nice to have someone like on with my family with me. So, you know, I'll feel better and it'll make me feel like just just better, like having someone with me on the field. And of course, there's Hannah and Leah's second family, their teammates. If, if I didn't have them, I probably like wouldn't be able to play like they're there for me all the time. And that's really appreciative of them, you know, and I'm thankful to have them all there for me and my family as well. For tomorrow's game, Athens will host Northeast Bradford at 530. And remember, wear pink in support of Sarah Reed and her family. We'll all have her in our hearts and on our minds that day.